Hi, and welcome to Call Cabinet's video tutorial library. In this video, we are going to deal with installing Atmos S4B, our desktop compliant call recording solution for Skype for Business. The first step would be to ensure that the Skype for Business desktop client has been installed. Atmos S4B supports all versions of Skype for Business and most versions of Microsoft Link Client. The next step would be to download Atmos S4B using the link provided to you by our sales or support team. The application is digitally signed, so you shouldn't have to worry about security. At this point, you can go ahead and run the application. Click Next, accept the license agreement, either change or accept the default installation folder. You will now be at the Atmos IDs page. In order to continue, you will need to enter the IDs that you received via email when creating your Atmos account. These keys are extremely important. They not only identify you as a client, but also aid in ensuring that your calls are 100% secure, compliant, and encrypted, and that the calls are associated with your account. In addition, you also have the option to set Atmos to run in silent mode. By selecting this checkbox, Atmos will run in hidden mode and be invisible to the Windows user. I am going to go ahead and look for the email I received when I created my account. And I am going to copy and paste the IDs into the installer. If you don't have the email, you can simply log into Atmos, click the Settings gear in the left navigation menu, and select Sites. Once you have entered your IDs, you can continue by clicking on Validate IDs. The application should now install in a matter of seconds. It should also be noted that we do have command line tools which can be used to simplify larger deployments. Once the application has been installed, you will see a new cloud icon in the system tray. By clicking on the icon, you will see the Atmos S4B window. You should see a checkbox in the first four blocks which will indicate that the application is correctly configured and ready to record calls. The on-call checkbox will be checked only when you are on a call. Finally, the Do Not Upload button will be enabled if you are on a call. By clicking this button, the current call will not be uploaded. This is useful in the event that you do not get permission to record the call or the call is of a personal nature. Thanks for joining us today. I hope this tutorial was useful. You can always reach out to us via our website support portal if you have any questions.